What is up, fellow trainers? I'm Trainer James, and you're watching Pokemon Soul Silver Dice Lock. This is episode number 20. Finally made it to the 20s, and last episode we took on Jasmine in Olivine City. Then we made our way here to the Lake of Rage. We caught a shiny red Gyarados. <laughs> and now we have story to get into. Tons of plot. So, we're standing right here, right behind Lance, Elite Four Lance, Elite Four Champion Lance. But first, we need to do a nice team recap. So let's start with Equator, the Poliwhirl, level 33, holding the Quick Claw. He knows Surf, Hypnosis, Body Slam, and Mud Shot. And next up we have Metroid, the Tentacruel, level 34. Not holding an item. Uh, she knows Bubble Beam, Water Pulse, Acid, and Barrier. And next up we have the newly evolved Cotton Body. The Ampharos, level 31, holding that magnet to power up its Thunder Shock and Thunder Punch. And it also knows Charge. And we taught out Iron Tail last episode, which we uh, got the TM from Jasmine. And next up we have Shucky, the Shuckle. Uh, level 30, holding the Soothe Bell. And it knows Strength, Encore, Bide, and Rest. And then finally, we have the MVP of the team. The original Mon from Episode 1. The only original Pokemon <laughs> that we have left. Um, we have Pyroback, the Quilava, level 34, holding the Petraberry. And he knows Flame Wheel, Dig, Quick Attack, and Smokescreen. Of course... There's Gyarados in our party, but like I said, we caught that in Lake of Rage last episode, so it's technically not in the party, because as you can see, it's right there. Alright, <clears throat> let's go talk to Lance. That red Gyarados wasn't acting right. As I feared, somebody must have forced it to evolve. Did you come here because of the wild tales? You were James. I'm Lance, a trainer like you. I heard some rumblings, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier, James. I could tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. I wouldn't hype me up too much. I've killed a lot of Pokemon, okay? If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? Sure. Excellent. It seems that the Lake of Rage's magic carp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mahogany is probably the cause in that suspicious souvenir shop. I'll be waiting for you in Mahogany, James. Flew off on his Dragonite. Too bad we don't have anything to fly on right now. But, unfortunately, we lost Supergirl. R.I.P. Supergirl. So let's get right on to Mahogany Town. Um, I'm not going in there. I don't want to have to pay when I can just jump over a ledge. Let's see. So we have to stop Team Rocket this episode. And I'm pretty sure it's that building, but I'm going to come in here and heal real quick. And then I will also drop off Primal Rage, our Red Gyarados. <laughs> Nurse Joy is going to heal us up. For free, because we like free healthcare. Canada. And then, so let's move. Oh. Look at that. It's a female with the adamant nature intimidate ability. It's too good. It's too good. I know if that gets added to the team, we would have a severe, uh, you know, electric weakness. Well, with Metroid, Equator, and then Primal Rage, but it's a red Gyarados. It's just a Gyarados in general, you know? Dragonite. Hyper Beam. 
What took you so long, James? I'm sorry, I don't have something to fly on, okay? Just as I thought. That strange radio signal is coming from here. The stairs are right here. James, we should split up to check this place. I'll go first. Oh man, Lance isn't taking any of your crap. Ugh! You found the secret stairway. How did you do that? I thought it was well camouflaged. You thought wrong. Okay, so. We need to start training up Shucky too, because we don't want Shucky to get left behind. Go ahead and weed with Cotton Body for now. We set off the alarms, guys! Team Rocket. Team Rocket Grunt sends out a drowsy. Good old Tasty Toes himself. It's Thunder Punches Drowsy. Good job, Cotton Body. A Zubat? Of course we're staying in. Thundershock. Putting this magnet to good use. Great use, in fact. Player defeated. Team Rocket Grunt. Then we have another one. Excuse me. Another Zubat. Zubit. Thundershock this Zubat. A critical hit. Good job, Cotton Body. Grimer. Nah, we'll stay in. I don't mind fighting a Grimer. Oh, I will thunder punch it. A rat tata. Staying on that too. Thunder shock. I feel like a thunder shock should take a ratata out, especially since we're holding the magnet, and it does. Good job, cotton body. Putting in the finest of work right now. Let's see. Are there any hidden items down here? No. How about down here? There's a scientist down there. Let's go find this scientist. That's right. Come battle me. Move so I can get that item behind you. Scientist Greg sends out a Magnemite. Well, I think it's time to go out into Pyro back. Thunder Wave. No! I don't like being paralyzed. Sonic Boom, we missed. Oh, they missed, I mean. With this Pyro back breaking through paralysis. Okoing Magnemites, left and right. Another Magnemite, we'll stay in. Flame Wheel again. Uh, we couldn't miss that Sonic Boom, though. Good job, Pyroback. I think Pyroback should have evolved level 36. So we're like a level and a half away from a Typhlosion, guys. Which means Pyroback 
You gotta stay with me. Look, Pyroback didn't get paralyzed once that match. Because Pyroback is trying to prove himself that he is the MVP. He sees that, uh, you know, Equator is trying to come up to that spot, that MVP spot from last episode. He's like, no, 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 no. I'm the MVP. But we can go ahead and use the Paralyze Heal. Ooh. I just realized, those spots down there, we can get an encounter in here. Gotta set this thing off. Set off the Persian alarm. Let Team Rocket know that we're in here. Team Rocket Grunt. Another Drowsy. It's fine. It's fine. Punching that Drowsy right in the stomach. Ugh. Cotton body's ready to level up as well. Thunder Shock. No sense in wasting a Thunder Punch on a Zubat when a Thunder Shock will take it out just as easily. Level 32. Ugh, I failed! Always. Team Rocket always fails. They should make a Pokemon game where you can choose sides. You can either be like, go on the bad team, or, you know, choose to be on the good team. It's Thundershock. I'll probably switch out here. I might go into Shucky. Maybe. Depends on what's coming out. A Grimer? Yeah, we can go out into Shucky. That's fine. Grimers tend to have more special defense than physical defense, so even though our attack stat sucks, our st actually, let's just bide. I don't really know what a Grimer is going to do to us anyways. Mud Slap. Okay, he's going to lower our accuracy. That's what Grimer is going to do, and then he minimizes. So he lowers our accuracy and then lowers or heightens his evasion. But I don't think, I'm pretty sure Bide always hits. Like, I, don't, I don't think it can miss. Let's go out into Equator. Disable. That's a mud shot. It will be super effective. Probably won't do much though. Huh. It does quite a bit actually. <laughs> Body slam this time. Shucky gets that extra experience because it was traded to us. We go back out into Shucky this time. Our opponent's Rattata. I'm just going to use Strength this time. I'm not even going to worry about Bide. We are part rock, so we, we resist uh, normal type moves anyways. Oh yeah, our bite would have done nothing. Good job, Shucky. 328. Okay. So, let's put Shucky out front. Battle this guy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I know about the four. Team Rocket Grunt. He has four Pokemon. Okay. Well, Shucky should definitely be getting some experience this time. Hyper. 
<laughs> Hyper Fang did one point of damage. It did flinch us, but still, only did one point of damage. Shucky laughed. It tickled him. Bite. Even a crit wouldn't have done anything. The strength animation is so slow. Rattata. Another Rattata. Watch this guy have nothing but Rattatas. Gonna focus energy. He knows he has to. He's like, the shuck was part rock. My normal type moves don't do anything. Let me focus energy. This Rattata should level us up. I'm pretty sure. And it does. Yeah. Level 31. Look at those defenses. 167 defense, 154 special defense. 17 attack and special attack, and then 13 in speed. Another Rattata. Um, let's go to Pyro back. The closer we can get you to level 36, the better. We got Shucky up one level, so it's not too bad, I guess. As long as Shucky doesn't fall way behind. You know? I'm probably going to try and keep all my Pokemon within, like, four levels of each other. Maybe I should keep them within three levels of each other, actually. So Shucky's at level 31. Pyroback's at 34. It's a three level difference. When Pyroback goes to 35, we'll have to do Shucky up to level 32. This sounds good. So I'm going to go to Equator. I think these are Voltorbs. I'm pretty sure. You know, Electro messed me up last time, so. Here it goes. Ugh. This rock. Oh, it's a Geodude. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's dupes, so. Take him out. Actually, we could just keep encountering on this until we get to the very last one. Just see what, uh, okay. I, okay. This will probably be the Voltorb. Yep. We don't have a Voltorb yet. So this is our encounter for, uh, Team Rocket Hideout, I guess. Let's see. Let's use Hypnosis. Hopefully you don't have an Electro-type. Light screen. That's fine. Light screen is A-okay with me. Man, that hypnosis went way over him. I wonder if we can just throw a ball. I wonder if that'll work. Two, three. It worked! We got Voltorb. discovered when Pokeballs were introduced. It is said that there is some connection. Uh. Bolly. <laughs> Bolly the Voltorb. Okay, I think this takes me back to the beginning. Pretty sure. So... Let's put you back out front. Set off this alarm. Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Team Rocket Grunt. 
Sun's out. Drowsy. Flame wheel this drowsy. Oko's. Good job, Pyroback. Zubat. What's. Got into Shucky. This Pyroback's about to level up, anyways. Let's see if a strength will take out Zubat or not. Probably not. Close! Very close. Strength again. 328. It should be fairly easy to level up Shucky. Since it gets extra boosted experience for being traded. Flame wheel Zubat. There we go. I think. Looks good. Pyroback 35 lava plume. Uh yes, please. An inferno of scarlet flames washes over all Pokemon in battle. It may also inflict burns. Alright, let's get rid of Flame Wheel. We're more of a special attacker than a physical attacker anyways. So Lava Plume would be better. Let's go back out into Shucky now. Leveling up Shucky. I am going to have to end up probably using that teleport, go back to the beginning, go back to the Pokemon Center, heal up some Pokemon, man. Okay, so he minimized, he lowers our accuracy, probably going to miss strength now, yep. Okay, let's go on to Metroid, Metroid hasn't been out yet. nothing a Grimer can do that can take out my Metroid. Even though this is super effective. Bubble Beam. Oh yeah, he minimized. That's right. Way to go, Grimer. Good job, Metroid. Send Shucky back out. Use this strength. Focus energy. It's a little too late for that, okay, Rattata? for some money. Let's see, what's down here real quick? That's a lance. Okay, well. Are you alright? Your Pokemon are hurt and tired. Here, give them some of my medicine. Well, I'm glad we didn't go back. James, let's give our best for Pokemon. Well, since you did that, I'm going back up. I have some other uh, surveillance camps to take care of, some more rocket members to battle. 
no point in uh, you know skipping out on this experience. Team Rocket Grunt. They all have the same, like Drowsy, Zubat, and then uh, Zubat, Grimer, and Rattata. It's for that lava plume. Zubit. Uh, Shucky. Strength, Astonish, Astonish. Wooderoy did nothing, wing attack, won't do anything either. One more strength. Man, I don't understand why strength's animation takes so long. There's no escape! There is escape. I've escaped all the other grunts so far. Zubat. Let's go. I have a plume, this Zubat. You know what? I'm just gonna stay in with Pyroback. Might as well get to level 36. Like, when a lava plume goes off, it sounds like an explosion. Okay, I'm gonna use lava plume again. Listen. Yeah. What happens if you... The eyes of the Persian statue are no longer glowing. Okay. Hyper Potion. Oh! Might as well do it. Like I said, no point in skipping free experience. Hey! Intruder alert! Sent out drowsy. Let's see how much quick attack does. <sighs> Not enough. And we got disabled for it. Guess we're just sticking to lava plumes. Slowly, we're getting their pyro back. Probably won't be next battle, but maybe the battle after that. Hmm. If only these guys would have different Pokemon. Like these battles wouldn't be so monotonous, you know? At the least, some of these like Rocket members could have, like you could give one of them maybe a Golbat, give another one a Hypno. Give another one a Raticate, another one a Muck. And they're all so vastly underleveled. Like, this is all free experience and everything. And I'm glad we're getting it, but. You know, it's just. They're so underleveled. It's almost as if it's not even worth it. But it is worth it! Because free experience. Of 
course, your Harden did nothing. Rattata. Lava Plume. I want to go find Lance, see if Lance can heal us again, maybe. Or if that was just a one time thing. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's all the statues. It is. Okay. Well, I guess we can go downstairs, find Lance. Oh man. Hmm. Venonat. Well, at least at least it's not a Zubat, a Drowsy, a Grimer, or a Rattata. Finally something a little different. Still the same level though. You know, those uh high teens. Another Venonat. You would have two Venonats. Were you seriously not expecting a trainer to walk in here with a fire type Pokemon? Because that is poor management. It's poor planning, I guess. Is there anything back here? Nope. There's a rocket member, and there's nothing up here, right? <laughs> Only the one who guards the boss's, boss's room knows the password to that door. Where's the boss's room? Who knows? Go look for yourself. Uh, okay. Door won't open, huh? 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 Golbat, finally! A better Pokemon. It's probably still going down to a lava plume. But hey, it's something other than a Zubat. 658? Just enough experience! Hit that delicious level 36. Here we go. Paru back. Good job, Paru back. Look at that Typhlosion. Walking on two legs. Huh? Pyroback is holding something. Would you like to take it? No. You can hold on to it. Pyroback seems happy to have found something. Well, I'm happy you evolved. Yeah. There's good old Lance. James, in order to unlock the door to the radio transmitter, you need the voice of a certain person. The name of the person is Petro, the Team Rocket executive. I have found out he is hiding in their leader's office. Unfortunately though, that room is also protected with a password. James, we need the password to the leader's office first. Okay. Well, we get this item. A full heal. Cool, cool. Great full heal. Go upstairs. Well, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode right here. So next episode, we will finish up the Team Rocket hideout. So be sure and come back for that. And if you enjoyed this episode, remember to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more Pokemon Soul Silver Dice Lot content. <sighs> Answer the question of the day down below. And until next time, I hope you guys have a great day. Bye!